What is going on guys? This is going to be real quick. Uh, one of the guys on SOL kind of asked you know, to show some differences between some of the greases I use. And in that thread were a gentleman by the name of Mark D on Stripers Online asked, uh, what's a good grease to kind of fill voids to prevent any water or sand from getting in? Just basically as a barrier. And I usually use like a Corrosion X or something like that. And you can see it's a fairly tacky grease. Kind of likes to stick to what it originally has bonded to, I guess is the best way to put it. Also works as a great moisturizer. And somebody had mentioned Aqua Shield. And since I love lube, when somebody says to me, just get it on your hands and you'll figure out why, uh, why they like it. Uh, I'm going to go ahead now and see what this is all about. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> this is kind of new. What the heck? Wow. That's some sticky stuff. Oh, we could have a lot of fun with this. I can't even get off my hands. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. Okay. Now, I've used a lot of lubes before. And not to get too personal, um, I tend to like NGL2 based lubricants. And I don't know. Wow, this stuff is like a paste. It doesn't even. Look at this. Okay. Doc Elmel. You are not exaggerating by saying, get this other stuff on your hands and you'll know what he's talking about. This is some, uh, this is some stuff right here. <laughs> I'm kind of, I think I got myself into a little bit of a situation. Look at this. Wow. Wow. Can we blow bubbles? <sighs> okay. All right. So, um, Let's make <laughs> as little mess as we possibly can. All right, give me a second. I'm gonna get a roll of paper towels here. Okay, so I pretty much wiped it all off. And look at this. It's still just the film wants to be all, I don't know what the proper term is for. Uh, all right, so. We're going to go, and it's very light. It's, it's, okay, like pasta. We're going to twirl and get a spoon for you pasta eating noobs. All right. And then, man, this is some interesting stuff. I, I've never used anything like this, and I've used a lot of lube. Tell your friends. Um, This stuff is a nightmare to work with. It really is. All right, so we got that in there. And let's get to handling. This is one of the most important things you could possibly do on any saltwater spinner, especially if they don't have any seals. Let's kind of plug that with as much grease as you can. And sometimes you might want to spin it. This is this stuff is ridiculous. But that's what we want. It's like a good mozzarella. I like this stuff. I wonder how it works on uh, gearing. You know, I saw a picture on the interwebs of an Abbott. I think it was an MX. And somebody used a very similarly colored grease. I have no idea what it was. I wonder if it was this stuff. Because the main thing you want in this kind of application, again, we're not talking about lubricating gearing or bearings or anything like that. We're just using it for a barrier. And we, come on, what's going on here? So we basically just want it to stay put. So there's a, a term new, uh, 
used called washout. And you don't want to have any washout. You want this stuff to stay put. And the Corrosion X stuff is fine. It is a, it's a much heavier grease. I mean, it's kind of a higher viscosity than this. But this is, see how it, I don't even know what the term is, how it stretches. It's like silly putty, only like liquidier. What happens if you mix it? <laughs> Jesus, stop! It's getting all over the place. This stuff sucks. <laughs> all right. Um, it's like we're mixing two flavors of bubble gum. That's actually um, pretty good. I'm not going to lie. I guess they play uh, nicely together. Because this is NGL2. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Well, this is Aqua Shield, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed this. Uh, here's the color, a little bit close up. I think it cost me 22 bucks shipped from marinesanitation.com or marinesand.com. Uh, eBay sells it for 32 shipped. So, hey, it's almost the same price as Corrosion X, which sells on Amazon for 19. This is the stuff I love for gearing and ball bearings. I'm going to start working with this stuff a little bit more. This is interesting stuff. So thank you all for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that. And I'm going to go wash my arm. <laughs> this stuff is all over the place. All right, guys, take care.